This is Luis Red with a Panacea News Report. Extinction. Is it real or something the Landwalkers came up with to scare us? We went into the sand to find out more from our citizens. Yeah, the water has been feeling a bit strange lately. It smells funny, you know? But then again, it could just be the natural cycle thing. Although, I haven't seen some of my pals in years. All I found was this weird can. First, they came for the whales. And I did not speak out because I wasn't a whale. Then they came for the tunas. And I did not speak out because I wasn't a tuna. Then even the little guys like the shrimp and lobster were gone. And I did not speak out. Well, we always helped keep things alive around here yeah. and try to be a safe haven for all you swimming youngsters in the sea. But recently, the place has seen better times. We'll be back to 100% in no time. That's right. Oh, got this. We're interrupting this program with some breaking news. Well, this guy doesn't even have eyes or a brain, but we got sued last time. We didn't allow him to speak. So let's hear it from this weirdo who claims he has a solution. Hello. I'm Max, and I'm a Caribbean sea cucumber. You know, the friendly sand suckers who hang out in your neighborhood? You usually ignore us, but guess what? I am the solution to a lot of pollution. <gasps> the fuzzy weenie? Go suck sand and leave us alone. We got this under control. Uh -huh. Let the corn dog speak. I'm not sure if he's a fish or a plant like us. All I know When temperatures rise, algae's blue, and algae's my favorite food. Algae's evil plan is no match for this slimy wonder full of hunger. The water's getting more acidic. Poop, algae, this place is a mess, but we love it. It's delicious. And in exchange for these delicacies, we give you a fresh, clean home. This just in, the crustacean candidate for Sultan of the Seas has proposed free maid service for all as part of his campaign. More on this at time. Sea cucumbers create protective bubbles around coral reefs by changing the pH of the water in their gut. They also minimize algae blooms by ingesting dirty sand and excreting all the good things corals need to restore, survive, and even thrive. Where sea cucumbers have healthy populations, seagrass grows eight times healthier. Who's the weenie now? <laughs> 